I do state governor Gordon Obaseki don't talk say make Niger politicians do everything with them fit do to make sure say Niger they united and say make them stop to the talk anyhow and stop to the do things we fit divide with country Niger along ethnic and religious lines. The governor Gordon Obaseki talk this one when him and a deputy right honorable comrade Philip Shaibu go break Ramadan fast with his royal highness Alahaji Ali Rumomo Ikelebe III, the Otaru of Auchi Kingdom for Esaka West local government of Edo State. Obaseki can talk say this month and week now very important time and holy week for Christians and also say we still they carry waka to the last 10 days of the Ramadan fasting period. He comes to talk say this time now one Obogai Tawa will not they see all the time. Say of say now the first time with the period of Lent and Ramadan they come together. He can call on Niger people especially at those state people say make them pray well out to take understand the presence of God over the affairs of with state and with nation. And say as them they do on before for the past six years they can still come again this year to come break fast with his royal highness the Otaru of Auchi will be the head of Muslims for Edo state. It's a very significant month, very significant week. It's a holy week for Christians and um, it's also as we're heading towards the fasting days of um, the Ramadan the fasting period which are supposed to be the holiest days of um, the Ramadan month and this coincidence you know should be humbling for people of both faiths Christians and Muslims that um, it's an unusual coincidence it doesn't happen often so there must be a significance in the fact that God Almighty has made it possible for us to celebrate the Lent, the period of Lent and Ramadan, you know, overlapping each other. It means for us Nigerians and, you know, citizens of Edo State that we must understand the presence of God in our affairs and in our nation, particularly at this point in time. It calls for sober reflection, it calls for prayers, and it calls for supplications to God Almighty. Uh, tonight we have the privilege as usual, we've done this uh, for six years except during COVID, to come and break fast with um, His Royal Highness, the Otaru of Auchi, who you know is the head of Muslims in Edo State. Um, it's significant, this is particularly significant as you know, because in the Christian calendar, Holy Thursday is the day our Lord Jesus Christ had the Last Supper. So it's about breaking fast, it's about breaking bread and fellowship. So we are glad that God has spared our lives to be here today, to see today and to come and break fast with His Royal Highness and pray that God Almighty continues to preserve Him, protect Him, give Him the wisdom required to rule his, over His people and also to provide leadership for us in Edo State. Obaseki Konsti talk say him and the deputy come here today say cops say they won't show Edo people say make them know they do religious divide as all of them be Christians and them still come come jolly with the Muslim leader. He can say no understand why when you reach politics now there will they talk more on our differences and division we no they read. Say him agree with waiting the elder statesman and former president of Niger chief Olusheg Obasanjo talk say we need to come together as people to see the wahala when Niger they face say he pass ethnicity and religion. Well the role of leaders. Um, is to overcome challenges and to give hope to the uh, people. Um, us being here tonight, myself and the deputy, shows that in Edo State, we do not see that religious divide. We are Christians and we are here to fellowship with uh, a Muslim leader. So religion cannot and should not be a basis for dividing us as a people. We've always lived as one, and um, we should understand that those who are playing the religious card are doing so for very, very selfish reasons. We've always had people of different faiths live in this country as one, and we've always interacted as one. When you go to your markets, to trade, to transact. You don't ask whether the person is Muslim or Christian or Igbo, Yoruba or Hausa. You do your business and try and get a fair deal out of, of that. So why now, when it comes to politics, we now want to begin to emphasize our differences, our divisions, which are really unreal. I mean, they, are, they have been heightened by uh, those of us in the political class. So I agree with uh, the elder statesman. Uh, that we as leaders need to do more 
to unite our people and to get them to see that the issues in Nigeria are beyond ethnicity and religion. It's about good governance. It's about responsible leadership and holding people accountable when they have duties or responsibilities to perform. The Ogboge people will follow Governor Obaseki do this work on Deputy Governor of Edo State, Right Honorable Comrade Philip Shaibu, Chief of Staff to the Governor, Honorable Sagbo Yoha, Commissioner for Trade and Investment, Official to Braimo, and the People Democratic Party, PDP, Deputy National Youth Leader, Timothy Osadolo, among others. From Aochi Kingdom, Edo State, Ekata Ojisele, TMC TV News.